Okay, I have a feeling that I'm gonna learn a lot of French while I'm staying with my host because she speaks really fast and she's using a lot of words that I don't know, so... So right now I'm headed to the Mac store because my iPhone is still not reacting so I'm gonna see if they can help me. I'm gonna head over there, have an appointment in about 35 minutes so I hope I have enough time. This is the first time in a while that I'm moving around without like a map. I'm just gonna be roaming around trying to get lost without getting stressed. <laughs> Success! I made it to the right bus stop without getting lost, but I'm running late. I'm very upset. Since I got here so late, they scheduled in another appointment about 2 hours and 15 minutes from now. And I really feel like crying right now. Two hours later. I freaked out for a second because they told me that I didn't have an appointment. They were like, no, it's not there, it's not there. I can reschedule another one in one hour. I was waiting here for two hours, so I started freaking out and I'm like, no, I need I need it now, I need my phone. And they're like, yeah, we understand, we'll get someone to you as soon as possible, so. So I am extremely, extremely bummed. They had to change my iPhone and also the cable was broken. I'm upset with myself a little bit because I feel like it's my fault because I noticed that it didn't charge but I thought it was just my imagination. I don't really care about material things. I could break my camera, I could lose my drone but if I lose what I treasure most which are my pictures and my videos I freak out for me what has the most value are moments or experiences so capturing experiences is like wow it's amazing you know I got to look back on them and I look back on the pictures and I remember that moment or whatever and not being able to do that because you lost all your freaking data is really upsetting yeah I'm really upset I'm not gonna lie everybody has their own priorities my priorities are my pictures and my videos another thing that I have to learn from this mistake I have to back up everything. I'm still gonna walk around and then I'm gonna head home. I probably won't go out again. I probably will just stay there because I'm a little bit stressed from this situation. Yeah, that's life. Almost home from this stop. It's much better than the other stop they had told me Okay, I was hangry before and I wasn't thinking straight I do have a backup of my photos on Google photos I can breathe a little bit more now and I have some food in my stomach now. I'm gonna go to the supermarket one eternity later well i decided to stay in for a while so now it's too late to go to the supermarket because they close super early here i'm gonna go to a mini épicerie that's open until 10 and i'll just get what i need for tonight's dinner and maybe tomorrow's breakfast dinner for tonight. I made myself a little baguette. That's it. Bye.